All right. Stuff in this test tube, kiddos, is called sodium polyacrylate. It's known as a super absorbent. Um, I have about a gram of it in this test tube. <laughs> um, unique property is that it absorbs three to four hundred times its weight in water. And I'm going to show you that today. It's pretty cool stuff. Uh, there are actually some neat applications uh, of using sodium polyacrylate. Some people have made gobs of money by incorporating this into everyday items which you are eager to buy. In fact, I'm not even going to guess. I will say that all of you have had sodium polyacrylate in contact intimately with, uh, with uh, many parts of your body. And you'll maybe find that use as we do the demo. So I'll take the sodium polyacrylate, put it in the speaker. Once again, that's about a gram. And I will add about three to 400 grams of water to this, and we'll observe what happens here. Can you see? We won't play that game today. All right. All right, so there it is. We'll walk it over to our friend Ta'ani. And he trusts me, doesn't he? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> and you can see the super absorbent uh, properties of the sodium polyacrylate. Um, how could you use this to make money? Very good. It's used in baby diapers. Um, underneath the lining, they sprinkle some of this. In fact, if you have a little brother or sister, or perhaps yourself, I don't know, and uh, you have a really wet diaper that you're changing, you can see actually little tiny globs of this. It's yellow, though, on their skin. Uh, that's what is also used in potting soil. Um, here's so something sort of gruesome. Morticians use it. Who? Morticians? <laughs> Why does it make sense? It gels up your body. No. Uh, <laughs> dead people, those who have passed on before us, have a tendency to leak. Um, and so the mortician little claws that they use, um, somewhat like diapers, um, use sodium polyacrylate. They incorporate it into the fabric to absorb that. So sort of unique and interesting. What does it feel like? I'll pass it around the room. It's pretty much not toxic. In fact, uh, there is one caution I need to give you. If you do come in contact with it with your skin, all of your children will be born naked. So it's sort of a, you know, So keep that in mind as I pass it around the room. All right, that'll work with us.